Why life school? Why life school? Well, where does that come from? Life school is quite a pretentious name. Um, why did I choose that? Well, I chose that all the way back in the weight training bodybuilding guide era as a side project where I tried to deliver some kind of philosophy. And that was typed and handwritten. And of course, well, I got some views, but the problem with handwritten philosophy is it takes some time to refine that. And it took me the best part of a year to refine one article. So I gave up on the life school idea. But the life school thing comes from two things. One, life school. Of course, this is the school of life, where everything that you learn is knowledge in the school of life. But the second reason is because when you say life's cool, quickly it sounds like life's cool. But life's cool. So it's the life school, but life's also cool. So that's where life school comes from. It's two names in one, most people don't get it. And so I'm a bit of a philosopher, you know, amazing, but um, I always hoped one day to release my own channel, the Life School channel, or, you know, the School of Life. Because when you think about it, how much of what you actually learned in school actually prepared you for life? Well, I know what an Oxbow Lake looks like, and I can, you know, add numbers together. But, apart from that, school could have been so much more. And kids these days, with ADHD, you really don't aren't really interested in school as much as we were because we had no choice. We'd get punished if we didn't. Well, I wanted there to be a place on the internet without so much disinformation and just telling the truth about life. Just things that people ought to know. Hence the life school. So there will be at some stage, maybe even hopefully leading on from today, me on camera talking about life in a YouTube channel about life school. And it will contain things like how to brush your teeth and how to do this and do that, uh, the secrets of youth and the power of water and the truth about certain things, the truth about drugs, the truth about alcohol, uh, the truth about pharmaceuticals, all kinds of things. The things that most people think but don't really know for a fact. Uh, we'll go through those things. How to do the dishes, how to do the washing up. And it's surprising that you know, unless people point out all kinds of things, you don't actually necessarily know how to do these things. And if your parents didn't know and their parents didn't know, who knows? Well, there's a lot of disinformation, misinformation floating around and without trying to put any ego on the matter I thought I'd finally stick my neck out again and do a few of these and try and share some information maybe not as much as Russell Brand but in that kind of a thing and what do I know? Well, what do I know exactly? What do I know? But, you know, there are lots of people on the planet doing exactly the same thing, so it won't make too much of a difference if I interfere with all that. And half the people will say, yeah, great, I really learned a lot from that, and the other half will say, oh, that was obvious. Or, that was rubbish, you know. So, it's one of those things I've always wanted to do. And I'm 39 years old. I finally, well, I want to do it, so let's do it, let's do it. If it works, it works. I'm not going to launch a Kickstarter to do it, I'm just going to do it. And I've written a book called How to Become a Philosopher. Again, link in the description. Um, blah, blah, blah. So that's all happening. Again, a non-profit, information sharing, kind of a um, project. So thanks a lot for that, and uh, I'd like you know, you know about me, about life school, so that's where all that comes from, thanks very much.